Hello everyone, this is Kevin Cruz here with Texas Orthopedic Associates in Dallas, Texas. We're a division of Lone Star Orthopedics. Um, here today talking to you about uh, shoulder surgery and uh, some of the reasons why we use the, the devices and implants that we use in shoulder surgery. The second s way that I fix a rotator cuff is with anchors. Um, and the company that I utilize for my anchors is Arthrex. The reason why I utilize Arthrex, Arthrex is the juggernaut in the sports medicine world. When you use Arthrex as a company, you know that the reps coming in there and the equipment they have is going to cover every single thing you could ever do uh, in the shoulder. Um, they have pretty much the, the largest sports medicine portfolio of products that, that exist today. And so you know that when Arthrex is in the room, that there's nothing that you're going to need to do that operation that's not going to be available. You know they're going to have high quality products and more importantly, they're going to have high quality reps because a lot of their reps, their their company representatives specialize in sports medicine. So you know you're going to have a great product line, you know you're going to have great representation, and you're going to have everything you need to fix that shoulder. And so for Arthrex, there's a several different sets of anchors that they have that I use. Uh, the system that I'm currently using now for a rotator cuff repair when I use anchors is a medial row, meaning right next to the joint we set a set of anchors. And I use an all suture anchor for this. And the reason why we use all suture anchors is because all suture anchors allow us to make a very, very small hole in the bone and set an anchor using a, a 1.8 millimeter drill hole versus using like a 4.5 millimeter drill hole for a larger anchor. We had, I think that that decreases the amount of bone I take out of your shoulder, which decreases the amount of pain you have during the operation and just a, a less of a footprint in your body of having extra material. And then what we'll do is we'll set that anchor past the sutures to the tendon and then we'll set it in a larger anchor laterally. Um, this is a double row repair. It's the strongest biomechanical repair for the shoulder. This is really the go-to for most uh, shoulder specialists who do a lot of rotator cuff repairs because what you're getting is several fixation points to get the tendon back down to bone. So we set the anchors medially and then bring the sutures through the tendon and then anchor them laterally. Um, the last procedure I want to talk about is if there are some patients that, that have such a bad tear in their shoulder that you, you can't fix the tendon or that if you repair the tendon to bone, it's so scarred in that it's at risk of pulling back off. And so um, Arthrex has actually done a really good job of creating a, a, a set of uh, instruments to allow you to do what's called a superior capsule reconstruction. And that's when we take a piece of allograft or tissue from someone who's passed away, and we actually anchor that into the socket, anchor that into the humerus. And the simplest way I can describe it is, is we're, you don't have a rotator cuff anymore. We can't fix what you have left, so I'm making you a new rotator cuff. And this isn't as good as having your native rotator cuff, but it's better than having nothing. And a lot of patients that we do this operation on, we're trying to not do an arthroplasty because you know, you're a young active patient, we're worried about the joint replacement wearing out. And so it's a really good option for those patients that have a really large retracted cuff tear or who have failed a repair already. And it gives us an option in order to fix your shoulder without having to replace your shoulder. Uh, and that's something that, you know, I was the first surgeon in Dallas to actually do that operation. Um, and that was four and a half years ago. And it has really skyrocketed in the last few years. And it's, it's a really good option for a small subset of patients.